Now the next step, we need to make sure that we infill this Archimedes screw or the coil that we've created because at the moment the shaft has got nothing to hold on to. So what we're going to do is just infill this through the middle. Now to do this we need to again create a new plane because we've got nothing to sketch onto. So what we do is just go up to plane and what we want to use just here guys is the one about halfway down angle to plane around edge. Now what that does is we can create a plane and set the angle to draw it on. Now what we can do is use the bottom of this screw down here and what we're going to do is just zoom in on here and select the face just here. Now what we can do is just drag it out a little bit and you can see we can select either two of the other planes that we've got. So what we want to do is select the plane which is down the bottom here. So just click that once and then it will give you an angle. So we can change the angle and I'll just give you a preview to show what it looks like. So that's at 30 degrees but what we want to do is make sure that that's 90 degrees to that face and then hit the green tick and then away we go. So now we want to draw a little circle to go all the way through. So what we want to do is create 2D sketch and just select this face down here or the plane down here. Once it goes white, click it. Now you can see that we're looking up through the coil now. So what we want to do is we want to match the circle that goes through the middle here. So all we do just now is click on the circle and we want to, it's not going to locate into the center and we'll tell you the dimension in a second. We just want to draw that circle. Now it should be around about five millimeters in diameter. And what we want to do is from that little dot just here, you can see how that's not quite lining up from this dot here, or the origin to the center of our circle. We want to make that 2.5 because that was the difference in our first drawing on our coil. So that's aligned it back in. What we want to do now, and that's pretty much it. We're just going to finish the sketch. And now we can see that that circle is down the bottom. So what we're going to do is extrude. So all we want to do, and now you can see if we need to change the direction of this. So change the direction using direction two over to here. So like that, now you can see that the coil is coming back up through the middle. Now we've made the coil 50 millimeters in height from top to bottom. So what we're going to do is make this slightly bigger. And we might make it 60. And we can see there that it's come back through the top. Actually, we'll change it back to 55. Because we can. And hit OK. And that, guys, is the second part of the Archimedes screw done. Well done.